This is the image many people have of LaGrange College in the summertime. No classes, no students, no life. But that's not the truth. Most summer classes are online, but the campus itself is buzzing with activity. I'm Mark Davis, Director of Development here at LaGrange College. Dozens of exclusive events make summertime on the hill the place to be. Sports camps, for example. While LaGrange College itself does not sponsor any of these independently run sports camps, the school takes great pride in having such a talented coaching staff. Sports professionals who care about their community and want to give back. Jeff Jeter's soccer camp celebrated 30 years in 2022. 30 years of helping boys and girls ages 5 through 8 and 9 through 14 improve their ball control and passing skills while learning more about fair play and sportsmanship. The purpose of the Panthers Youth Basketball Camp is to properly teach basketball fundamentals in an upbeat, energetic way. Head football coach Earl Chambers sponsors a summer youth camp that teaches valuable life lessons about responsibility and hard work while improving each youngster's skill level and confidence. Head baseball coach David Kelton, after guiding the Panthers to their fifth conference championship in a row, regional and super regional championships, and a first time visit to the College World Series, began his summer by hosting a camp designed to teach young players the basics of throwing, catching, hitting, bunting, and base running. New student orientation. It's a chance for freshmen, transfer students, and their families to connect, learn more about campus resources, and complete any last steps toward enrollment. As the first order of business, parents met with administrators, faculty, and staff to discuss important topics such as financial aid, campus security, and what the school expects from its students academically. Meanwhile, their offspring were divided into small groups and assigned an orientation leader. Mackenzie Hornsby, a biology major from Realtown, Alabama, is one of those leaders. By doing this, I'm able to kind of just make connections with those kids coming in and kind of help them like understand what college is going to be and make it a little less anxious and scary for them. Coming to orientation is when you get to know people. So this is really the time that you get to know the freshman class and the people that you're going to be spending the next four years with. Um, and it kind of honestly just gives you more of the feel of the energy on campus. So I think that it's important that students come um, whenever they can to an orientation session just because it really kind of gives you that clarification that this is going to be your home. When I talk about summer orientation with alumni and friends of the college, the question always comes up. How well has LaGrange College rebounded from the nationwide decline in enrollment caused by COVID-19? For an update on how this fall is shaping up, here's Director of Admissions, Nicole Maddox. We're up uh, in freshmen, about 55% from where we were this time last year, and transfers about 69%. So things have, have really jumped up this year. We're kind of getting back to normal from COVID, and I think we can see that. I think a lot of that has to do with friends that have come here and liked it. We see a lot of nursing transfer students as well. Uh, we've been able to go back to our normal two tours a day. We do one at 10 and one at two, and that's opened up to more families than we were able to do before. But I think once we get the student on campus, then it's all said and done. They get here and they love it, and I think that's, that's been a big piece as well. It's been a busy summer here at LaGrange College, and the excitement shows no sign of stopping. Move-in day, all new classes, cooler weather, football season. There's a lot to look forward to this fall, and we hope you'll continue to be a part of it all with us here inside LaGrange.